Hello everyone and welcome to this lesson where we will look at how CSS module stylings apply on different routes or you can say different pages when you are developing some website on Next.js. So let's get started. So if you recall in our initial sessions what we did was we actually committed out the import global.css. So what was this? This was basically if you enable this import it will apply a CSS styling to all of your pages globally. So if you can see over here, we have the stylings applied and even if you go to the dashboard, you will see the same styling has been applied to the dashboard page as well, which means that the global.css apply globally to all of your web pages. So I will comment it out for now and you will see that what are the benefits of using Next.js to give different stylings on your different web pages. So let's say we have the dashboard page over here and we want to apply a different styling to this one. So what I will do is inside the dashboard, I will create a new file. And let's name this file as styles.module.css. Now over here, I'm going to start a new styling. And what we are going to say is we need a minimum height of 100 viewport. Display be of type grid. We want the content to be placed in center and let's give it a background color as well. Okay, let's save it. So with that being done, what we will do is now we will go to the layout file over here for the dashboard. So this is the layout file for the dashboard and over here we will import the styling. So import styles from and then the file name that we have created styles.modules.css. Just save it over here and then in here after the navigation, what we want to do is we basically want to apply this styling onto the children. So basically what the children is, is whatever the content is inside our web page. So for that, I will create a tag for main and then we will give in a class name. So the class name will be styles.main, the one that we created just now. And now the children will come inside this tag so that whatever the stylings we want to apply goes to all the children in the dashboard. So you can see over here, now we have that color, we have 100 viewport screen and we can also see that the text is centered. And if you go to home, you will see that you have a global CSS applied over here. And even if you go to the dashboard, you will see over here that on the dashboard, we have the stylings applied only to the dashboard page. And if you notice over here, this was a different section, which is the part of the home page. And you will also notice that the same styling, the white color applies to the navigation bar over here. And if you go back again to the home, you will see that it has a global styling applied. And on the dashboard, we have the stylings that we have applied just right now. So let me go back and let me just enable the import global so that we have a greater difference being noticed over here. So you can now see if you go to the home, you have the main global.css applied to the main page and also to the dashboard, but you can only see it over here because this is a different section starting for the dashboard page. So with this, I hope you have got an understanding of how you can actually apply CSS modules to different web pages or different routes to your Next.js application. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe our channel so that you can get more informative videos like this.